Hey YouTube, so another while well, I was at it with a 3240 I thought I'd pull this little girl out. This is uh, one of the first 3030s ever made. Uh, it was made in 1896. <clears throat> it's a model 94. It's a 26 inch octagon barrel. Um, since I was at it I pull it out and do a review too. I've always meant to do a review on this gun but I never really got around to it. So this is basically a part of project I never never got finished and speaking about me going to the show tomorrow I might bring this along I don't really want to part with it but I probably could to the right buyer um, it's pretty special I think like I think it's one of the first 3030s you ever made it's a bit rough but um, with the right collector it would definitely fetch a good buck I uh, like I said I don't really have any intentions to ever get rid of it but it's uh it's got a special place for me but i don't, I don't take it hunting it's it's too big the the octagon barrel and 26 inches just heavy there's not much there's a lot of meat on the barrel it uh it really really isn't a nice gun to handle it's heavy it's old um like i said it's a 3030 so i load some pretty hot 3030 so don't bother with it that much on this gun because it just i don't i don't want to hurt it <laughs> <clears throat> so if you, I don't know if you can ever see serial numbers on this or not, but it's hard to see there. But so the serial number of that one is fifty three thousand zero seven one, which makes that a very low model ninety four. I'm not too sure. You see, a few of them survive with low numbers, but this one's, uh, like I said, pretty rare. I think. <clears throat> It's got the original front stock. The back stock I have too, but it's, somebody cut it down, so it's a pile of shit. But like I said, it wouldn't be a big deal to, to restore this to factory original. I might, I was even considering sending this to Turnbull, but you can't seem to get a straight answer on them on how much to restore. Their ballpark was 2500 for a restore, but they had to see the gun. You have to send it down there, and the red tape's ridiculous. So Anyway, I, I just thought I'd pull that one in the closet too, so... Um, <clears throat> like I said, it's not a big priority to to sell this. I don't think I ever will, but with the right offer, I probably would. But like I said, I just I I like working guns that I can take hunting, and this really isn't one. It's just just too big. It's too heavy. And for ninety four, that's saying a lot because this gun, I think, in a carbine weighs six pounds, and this gun must weigh about nine because of the barrel. So anyway. <clears throat> Anyway, it's a pretty neat old gun, so I'll post these up on YouTube. I really appreciate all the, the views I get, even though I don't think I'm very good compared to others, but I really appreciate all the all the views I get, so this is awesome. Anyway, guys, that's a quick 30-30 review. Like I said, she's an old girl, but a goodie, so anybody has any comments, I'd love to hear them. Thanks.